Okay, this is June with New Orleans Potions, and in this video, I want to make like a turquoisey um, blue color. So, or actually turquoisey green color. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this, I get from tkbtrading.com, and this is the chromium green oxide. And I am going to, because I'm gonna make a polish and a Gel, uh, nail polish and a gel polish, so I'm going to put one dash. I'm sorry, this is my tad spoon. Okay. And then I'm going to use two medium scoops of my titanium dioxide. And this should be enough. I'll probably have some left over. Okay, I'm going to mix this a little bit and then I'm going to use the mortar and pestle to grind it. And we'll see what color it comes out to be, but that's how it looks before I get started. Because I added the white, it lightened it up, so it looks like I'm going to get the color I want without adding anything else to it. Okay, it's going to take you about one or two minutes to grind it, but I think I'm done, and this is the color I want. So I'm going to dust this off. Kind of scrape everything to the center. You should use an old brush. Okay, now that that is ground, I'm going to put the funnel in and I'm, and I'm going to put at least a pinch let's see let's push that down and I'm going to put probably two pinches in the gel in the uh, nail polish bottle to get the color I want Something comes out a little bit lighter because this bottle holds a little bit more. Okay, let's push that in. Actually, I think I'm going to add a smidge more. So this would be a pinch and a smidge. Okay, we're gonna put the alcohol in here. All you have to do is give it a good shake and you get your color. This gel base I get from GRI Laboratories. I'll put the um, website in the description. Okay. Now we're going to fill this. Okay, now that's full. Fan out your brush. Twist it down pretty good so the stopper goes in. And just give it a good shake for about a second or two. Okay, I have gel base coat on here, so I'm going to polish on there so you can see what it looks like. Going to pop that in the light for 30 seconds and while that's doing that we're going to put some alcohol in the polish bottle and this is 91 percent alcohol 
And then we're just going to shake this one as well. I try to make matching nail polish and gel polish for work. Okay, now that that's shaken up real good, you can see how it looks. It's real pretty. I'm not sure if it's shaken. And then what I'll do is run it down the side so I can see how it's clear on one side so I can see how it's filling. Now that that's full, I'm going to take this out, put a second coat, and then we're going to shake that. Pop that back in the light. Okay. Make sure you put at least, I like to put three beads in the gel polish for shaking it, and I like to put two beads in for the nail polish. Okay, now that that is cured, I'm going to put some, I didn't put a base coat because I didn't, I just want to show you what the color looks like. So if I put a base coat, it would have grabbed better. Okay, let's put a top coat on the green. It's more green than I wanted, but there's really no bad color. So even if you make something and it's not exactly right, it's fine. Okay, we're going to pop this back in the light for another 30 seconds. I just put top coat. Okay, that is done. That's two coats of polish on this nail and two coats of gel polish on this nail with top coat. So this will be a little shinier, but I did not put top coat, but you can see that both the colors match. Okay, this is June with New Orleans Potions.